Welcome to MLB The Show in this presentation of Minor League Baseball. Tonight, the second of four between the Salt Lake Bees and the Las Vegas 51s. It's baseball on the show, and it's coming up next. Robert starts. A right-hander from the Empire State gets the starting assignment here. What do you have for us on him, H? Well, Matt, we're watching one of the hottest pitchers in baseball right now. His last three outings, his ERA, hey, zero. Right. He's going, he not given up anything. He continues that trend. He's going to have a phenomenal season. HR, right. our home nine as they begin play here this evening. They came up a little short last time out, but they've still been one of the hotter teams around, winning eight of their last ten ball games. Matt, they're on one of those hot streaks. I mean, every Everything is going right for them. They're playing great baseball right now. I mean, timely hitting. The bullpen's coming through. It looks like they're, they're rested. They're doing the things they need to do to really be a winning club right now. Hey. Barry Parker is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself down a strike. It's 0-1. Oh, has him looking silly here. It's 0-2. After that swing, you just got to reset yourself. You still have a strike to work with, and you, you can't be thinking about how silly you just looked on that last pitch. From the belt, the pitch, and he got him. And now we'll look at the starting lineup for the visitors in this one. What's this lineup have to do tonight in order to get a W here on the road, HR? Well, Matt, this is a very aggressive club. They steal a lot of bases. They're not at the top of the league, but, man, they're right there. They're not far behind. They will run at every opportunity they get to try to force mistakes. At the plate, Albert Pujols. He comes in currently tied for third in home runs on the team. From the stretch. Right over the middle, knee high. Runners on first with one down. A high fastball is in there. Well, if you're wondering if he's going to be loose for this game, there's our answer. 98 in the first inning. He's going to be coming right out. And a great pitch there as Pujol swings and misses, and it's always a sigh of relief when you can set him down. That's back-to-back -back strikeouts now as they've been unable to advance that leadoff single into scoring position. Yeah, clearly no problems working out of the stretch right now, Matt. He's taking control of this inning after giving up that hit. Now we'll see if he can finish it off strong as well. Here's the 0-1. And this is fouled back and out of play. Two out with the man at first. And here's a ball hit in the air. Balls up! I go, I go! Flowers will put this one away, and the side is retired. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors in a... Here comes the first the pitch. Ramon Cazada is in to start things out as he swings and misses at that one at strike one. Well, I'm almost sick in my head up here, Matt. Another pitch right down the middle. Now, early in the game, he's getting away with it. But if he wants to have any length in this game at all, he's going to have to get the ball in the corner. Swing and a miss on the slider, and that's out number one. Time for a look at the majestic defensive alignment for the home team. And these guys committed two errors last game, and it cost them. Oftentimes, you'll see an error committed, that and that ends up leading to a run. It hurt him last game. Hopefully, they'll catch it in this one. And into center field as he's aboard with a one-out single. Cut hold. At the plate, Jeremy Rhodes. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. First pitch fastball swung on and missed 0-1. The 0-1 pitch. Swing and a miss out in front of a changeup. The 0-2 home. Lifted down the line and right and back hey, out of play. Up here, here holds it 0-2. Ready with another 0-2. And now hey. a slider in there for a called third strike. And there are two gone now. That's what you call clipping the outside corner. Great movement on that slider. And it completely locked up the hitter. Didn't fool the umpire, though. Into the box, that Richie Hurt, as with two away, Richie he'll swing and miss with the first pitch. It's 0-1. He comes in at 262 on the year. Two home no runs and a dozen RBIs. Oh, he hey, looks like he's playing huh? with him here. It's 0-2. 
And a fastball called strike three, and the side is retired. One hit, one left. We'll go to the bottom half of inning number. Now batting, Gregorio Petit. And he'll start out there half of the third, top of the order to follow. And here's a fastball called for strike one. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Got a big pass at a slider that gets past him. Well, he doubled up on that slider, so that tells me he's really feeling it at this point in the game. Good chance we'll see a heavy dose of that slider as this start continues. Made a miss on the off-speed pitch that time. Gregorio Petit goes down for the first out here in inning number three. Into the box now. Bryce Fielder. Fox as he tries to go out and get the slider, but it's not there. It's strike one. He's singled to open up the ball game. Hey. Tough one to lay off, called a strike. Help. So he threw the slider darting away to him two times in a row. Now I don't think he'll go for it again. I'm looking for something hard inside on this pitch. And he is in complete control now. Seven strikeouts as this is swung on and missed for the second out. Boy, he's got great stuff today, doesn't he? That's seven punch outs now here in the middle innings. He's up over one in the inning up to this point. It'll be interesting to see if this lineup can change their plan of attack and start to put the ball in play. But right now, that's just not happening. Barry Parker is in with two away here as this one swung on and missed for the first strike. Hey, two out. Plays it one. He's finding his groove out there now. It's 0-2. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one ends the inning. So add one more name to the record book here as he strikes out this side. Here's Albert now. 0 for 1 Leading for him here in this one. Out. The designated hitter, Albert. Yeah. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0 and 1. Here we now go. I'll Pick it up. What, I go. love how he's pitching right now. He has continued to pound that first pitch for strikes. When you do that, oh, you set yourself up for great success. Now a swing and a miss by Pujols, and he's in a quick 0 and 2 hole. And he punches out another one, make it nine for the ball game. He's just bringing up strikeouts left and right. But what's really impressive to me, he hasn't walked anyone either. He's just pounding the zone. His stuff is dirty today. Stepping in now, Sean McCormick. As we run away, he can't make contact on the first pitch. It's strike one. 0 for 1 after a pop out in foul territory his first time through. Comes back with a fastball up and away that swung on and missed. 0 and 2. And he struck him out. So double digits now. 10 strikeouts for him thus far. That's 10 strikeouts for him now. And I'll tell you, he could rack up quite a few more before he's done. Still a lot of game left in this one. First baseman number Into 17. the windup and the pitch. Ramon, hey. Ramon Quezada. Quezada. Hey, standing in for the here. second time now as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. If you're able to locate your fastball like that, Zero. you're going to have a good game. I'm not surprised to look up and say he's having a good game right now because he's been spotting that fastball pretty good in most of the game. Boy, he looks strong. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Three up, three down, three strikeouts. Not and digging in to try it again. Charlie Leading off Haywood. With a B. He's in Zero. to get things Haywood. going here in inning number Charlie five. Haywood. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. Right count. by him okay. here, and he's set up for another strikeout here. The count to 0 and 2. Here it comes. Uh, he's just rolling right now, and even dozen strikeouts for him in the ball game. I'll tell you right now, this guy has a shutout going, and it's been all business. He's not messing around trying to pick at corners. He's being aggressive in the zone, and he's attacking each and every one of these hitters the up to this point. Number 13. Jeremy Rhodes is at the plate now, and he's quickly behind 0-1. One out, nobody on. Swing and a miss, and he's in trouble now, 0-2. I got to say, his command of the corners in this start has been 
pretty exceptional. Oh, he's mixed but east now, and west really and well, and it's a big reason why he's had success. Jeez, finally. No, that's that's the first ball they've taken all night. Hey, come on, now. Do it again, I dare you. Well, that's great discipline. He's clearly sticking with his plan. Those two balls were down. He's thinking to himself, make him get it up before I swing. Get it off the knees. So we got him swinging. Jeremy Rhodes becomes the second out here in inning number three. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. So they breeze through this half of the inning. Home half of the fifth coming. Digging in for his second at bat. Gregorio Petit. He'll start off. things out in the sixth for a lineup that really hasn't hey, found its groove in here. this one. Yeah, only two hits so far, Matt, and not very many no hard hit balls straight. either. We'll see if they can start making some adjustments. No else here. Struck him out and make it 14 punch outs now in the game. <laughs> Matt, just about everything he's doing is working. All of his pitches, great command, great location. And the big key, with two strikes, he's attacking the zone. Now some action out in the bullpen as a lefty and a right-hander begin throwing. Right fielder. In now, Bryce Fox, a hit in two at-bats for him at this point in the ballgame. And he takes strike two. You know, when a guy starts to get tired, you often see their breaking stuff start to flatten out, but that's not the case here. Still has really nice finish on that slider, as we just saw. So he throws him for the strikeout. Bryce Fox goes down for out number two in the top half. Ready once again, Barry Parker. First two men in the inning have both Barry gone down via Parker. the punch out, yeah, so we'll see if he can fare any better. Swing and a miss on the slider, nothing and one. A wave and a miss, a tick behind a good fastball. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Now a flare out toward right center. Take it, take it, take it. Ranging into shallow it, right, and that retires the side. Pretty painless half of the inning, all told. Heart of the order, 3-4. Here's Albert now. He's hoping to Leading avoid the, the hat trick. He struck out in each of his first two play Aye. appearances Ooh. so far. Oh, in count. there for strike one, 0 oh, and 1. Oh. And that misses 1 and 1. These guys have got to be frustrated as an offensive unit so far in this one. They haven't been able to crack the code on their opponent, but it's not like they're getting great pitch to hit either. This starter has kept the ball on the corners of the zone all game long. And here's a ball hit in the air. I go, Leifer I go. Is there for it. And that's the first out of the inning. Ready for another chance. Sean McCormick. Fielder, Third trip to the plate for Sean him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. And we see a lefty and a right-hander start to loosen up in the bullpen. Now a swing and a fly ball. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. I think a big reason why he's been so effective in this one that he's been just about getting ahead of every hitter. Seems like every one of them are 0-2, 1-2, and, and it's just about every at-bat. And when that's the case, your chances of getting a good pitch to hit are way worse. Pretty clear he didn't like the call there on the outside part of the plate, but probably too good to take, and he's down on strikes for the second time. Yeah, that pitch was right on the black. Not Beautiful bad. pitch. And even if we had robot umps, he'd still be out. But the only difference would be he wouldn't be able to complain about it. Well, he got what he's looking for. Right, he just got now. out in front of it right there. Zero. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Boy, he's been great in this one. He's only one strike away from putting him up. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and Ladies that and will retire it's the side. The so no runs, no hits, strike. no errors, and no one left. We'll move on now to the bottom half. Into the windup and the pitch. Charlie, Charlie Hayward swings and misses there. So he's down 0 and 1. And here's a swing and a miss as he falls behind nothing and two. Looking to punch him out again, the pitch. Struck him out. 18 strikeouts for him now.
pitching certainly has been on display in this one and there's the evidence of it right there one nothing our score the as there are 15. an awful lot of zeros on that Jeremy. line score to this point <laughs> Jeremy Rose is at the plate as he takes a cold strike one and now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there strike two at a pitch that catches the outside corner strike hey. three. 19 strikeouts for him now. If this doesn't boost your confidence on the mound, I'm not sure what does. That's six pitches and two strikeouts in the inning, and that was a really nice fastball for the punch out on that one. Now Standing in now, Richie Burt. Richie Burt. Chopped foul over towards the dugout. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame hey, so far. Here. Swing and a little blooper to center. Stacy ranging oh, forward. Oh. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. So they go quietly here in this half inning. Ready for another shot now. Gregorio Petit. He struck out right. twice thus far, Gregorio so we'll see if he can fare any better here. Oh, Gonzalez you, take it, take moves mine, over. Mine, mine. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Riding in once again, Bryce Fox, right fielder, Bryce. in there for strike one. Down, one down, one down. I really like how he's been throwing a lot of first pitch strikes in this game. That first pitch strike, it just opens right. up the whole strike zone and what you can do as a pitcher. And he gets him to swing through that one. He's in control, 0-2. Faces are empty, one man out. And that's swung on and fouled straight back. Hey, get him yourself right here. Let's go, baby. And another foul ball. That's probably not what he wants to do with two strikes right there with the fastball. He is fortunate he just fouled it off. Got him for an even 20 strikeouts now thus far as he's just been flat unhittable. Yet another strikeout for him on the mound. And fellas, this has been one of his favorite victims tonight. That's the third time he sent him packing. So he's got him pretty well figured out. Not that the rest of this lineup has been much better. Stepping in and ready for another no shot. Barry Parker. He's their Barry last shot here with Parker. two away in the ninth as they look to you, you avoid the it. shutout. Got yeah, it, man, got they it, just have it. Head. It. Is there. Makes the catch and the ball game is over. Yeah, they could only manage two hits against him the entire game. So they were never really in a position to even challenge him. Rock solid win and a memorable performance. And that one run held up tonight, one nothing the final. Las Vegas earned the victory despite only collecting four total hits. Robert Starks. Burns win number seven on the season as he allows only two hits over nine full innings. So that's a wrap here tonight. Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, Matt Vaskersian, you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Facebook at MLB The Show. Four hits, no errors, left seven men on base. A coach acknowledges a pitcher on his recent spree of strikeouts. He's on a torrid pace. They'll see if he can keep it up.